Hi guys, are you wondering how you can uh, monetize basic products you create on Canva? Um, if for adventure you're seeing me for the first time, my name is John Opanachi. I'm the founder of Value Monetization. This channel you're watching. So do all well to smash the subscribe button and don't forget to hit the notification bell. So what do we do here? So we teach people how to monetize their skill set, their expertise, and their knowledge. So we help people create a business model for their passion. So what is a business model? A business model is that thing that unites the value that you offer to a specific audience who will pay you in return. So if you are a returning subscriber, welcome. If you're just joining us, hit the subscribe button. And don't forget to smash the notification bell so that when next we upload a video, you will be notified. So don't skip any part of this video so that you don't miss out some key fact because we are teaching you how you can monetize some basic product that will not cost you money and upload it on Etsy or even eBay and make so much money from it. So I'll be exploring eBay and ST today, but I will first look at Etsy before we move into eBay. So we're using Canva, ST and we're using Canva, ST and Etsy and eBay. So let's do it guys. So the first website we'll be analyzing with similar web is called, we'll be using an extension called similar web, um, a website web or similar web extension. So we'll be analyzing this website first to know their ranking and secondly, to know the number of visitors that visit this website on monthly basis. So let's first, the first website we'll be analyzing is called um, uh, Etsy.com. So let's look at Etsy. How, what does Etsy rank? So we're using similar web, effortlessly analyzing Etsy. So this is Etsy. Etsy is an online marketplace, an e-commerce, like an online marketplace where people come to shop. So that is what Etsy is all about. So we want to analyze how many people visit this website. We want to know the global ranking. We want to know the, the in terms of country, the rank, and category-wise, what does it rank. So let's check it out. So we're looking at it right now. So if you can see for yourself, you will discover that uh, in terms of, um, let's see, if you, if you look at it very well, you discover that in terms of um, uh, globally, um, similar, um, Etsy.com rate rank 59. Um, countrywide, when it comes to the US, it ranked number 31. In terms of um, category-wise, it ranked number four. Now, let's take a look at the number of visitors that visit this website on a monthly basis or in the last one month. In the last one month, we have about 484,384.3 uh, million people have visited this website in the last one month. So that's amazing. So, and the bounce rate is about 46.33%. And the page per view is about 6.3% nine minutes so that makes it more more interesting seeing the number of visitors that come to this website on in the last one month so that's the first website we'll be looking at so another website we'll be looking at is called canva.com canva.com so let's take a look at canva canva is um, a platform where you can customize your design where you can customize basic designs, that are designs that are even finer than designs that are better than PowerPoint slides, designs that, oh, it's like you are, you are being your own self graphic designer and create your basic um, designs for your posters, your whatever, banner, anything you want to create for yourself. So we're using Canva, canva.com. So let's see what Canva rank globally, countrywide, and whatever wide. So we have Canva, globally, Canva rank number 79. Why, in terms of countrywide, USA, Canva rank number 123. Why, 
uh, category rank, Canva is number one. Now, let's see the number of visitors that visit Canva in the last one month. So, the number of visitors that visited Canva in the last one month is about 457 million people have visited Canva in the last one month. That is amazing. That is mind blowing. So, let's use this website and efficiently or effortlessly digest this website. So, let's look at them. So let's take a look at, um, this is, um, what's this website called? Etsy. Etsy is an online marketplace where a, a million of, a, a million, a, a millions of people come to shop on monthly basis. So these are digital planners. So there are a lot of digital planners. So let me go to the, um, to the product, to the search uh, engine and search for, um, digital planner so that you see exactly what i am talking about digital planner so this is digital planner you have a number of one digital plan you have the stickers you have so i just click on digital planner so the digital planner has opened so i'm looking for a product that sells very well or that sold so much on this platform so on my way going i keep going and i'm still searching for a product that sold so well I am still searching for because I have not found any. So um still searching for. I'm still searching for. Uh, I, there was a product I saw that I sold so much. Um, okay, let's take a look at this very product. This product so far, or this product so far, you can see the highest selling products here. Um, this product so far has sold. So let's take a look at how many products this product has sold so if you take a look at this little product it has sold 21,200 of 21,547 42 sales 21,542 sales that's what this product has done so far so we're going to multiply 11 points 11.30 times 21,542 sales so let's take a look at um, Google. Let's go to Google and multiply 11.30, 11.30 multiply or times, times um, 21,442. So the total number of sales that has been, the amount that has been sold so far is about 24,000 200 okay it's about 242,229 pounds so in the last one month so this product has done 200 and over 2 or, 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 almost 250 pounds almost 250,000 pounds 250,000 pounds so that's what this product has done so far so let's go and create a digital planner that is best suit for this product that best suit this product that we have searched for so we're going to Canva. we're going to create the cover for this digital planner this is a cover this is 2023 2024 digital planner so this is another digital planner because i i will, we will not be able to get this exact one because i have not uh, subscribed to my i've not gone premium on Canva. So, but we need to go premium on Canva before I can create an excellent digital planner. So we'll come to Canva and type digital planner, digital planner. After typing digital planner, we are searching for the best digital planner that we can buy, that we can create on Canva. So we're still searching. We've not found any yet. So if we find anything suitable, we will go for it. So something that is similar to what we actually saw and something that is selling so fast. So we can stick to any planner that we see that is very, that is good enough for us to use. So we're actually looking for, so let me just take, for instance, I'll take any digital planner at this junction. So let me take, let's assume this is a digital planner that we will be using today. So we need to click on customize our product, our digital planner. 
So after clicking on customize our digital planner, so it's opening. So the digital planner has opened. So if we want to multiply this page, we multiply, like we multiply the number of pages that we want. So all we need to do is copy this and bring it here. Then um, do the needful, just do what is needful. This is page three. This is uh, page one, page two, page three. If we want more pages, we keep going. We'll do the number of pages that um, we want to use for our customization. So if we want to turn, whatever we want to, let's assume we want to change this one into something else. We want to change it into um, goals for the year. So you have um, goals. Goals for the year, the year, right? So that has been written. So we we'll just reduce the font size. So we'll just reduce it to um, this way. So once, uh, sorry. So once it's reduced, so we can change. We can decide we want to change the color, the color or. Okay, go for the year. So we've written that. So write um, digital planner here. Um, digital planner. Okay. So we can decide to ex to min. Okay, let's minimize it to make it suitable for the purpose we are using it for, and we'll do same for other pages other pages that are above it and then um, do everything that we've done to page one we'll do it to page two we'll do it to page three we'll do it to page four every pages that we that that is occupied so we, we can't um duplicate everything that we've done to one page to other pages and it will be done from there let's assume this is my digital planner work that i've done so far all i need to do is come here click on um, the, uh, the, you can see the arrow that is pointing up. You click on it. Um, you go, you move down a bit and click on download. Once you click on download, um, it, you click here to download the product and it drops. So once your product drops, once this product drops for you, you already have an, S, uh, an Etsy shop where you have created. All you need to do is go there, list your product on Etsy and get review and get people to make review for your product and once the reviews are made you start selling your product so imagine what you can make out of this amazing product and one way to get to get higher sales is to first for first um you can there are different ways is to drive a number of traffic to your product alternatively that means you'll be spending money on ads every day or every month or once in a month or whatever you want depends on the number of products you want to sell and another thing is have um this as i said the higher the higher the demand the the higher the price the lower the quantity demand and the higher the price the 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 the, the, the higher the, the lower the price the higher the quantity demand the higher the price the lower the the lower the the, the higher the price the lower the quantity demand the lower the price, the higher the quantity de uh, demand. So it's vice versa. So if the price is down, the demand will be high. If the if the demand is high, the price will be down. So it's just the price is down, demand will be high. If the demand is low, the price is obviously high. So if, for instance, you listed a product and you discover that the there's no petrol, is it up? Is it that your product is not attractive enough, or the offer, the the, the price tag? is too high so you need to reduce your price but then do your findings about whatever product you are creating on canva and you are listing it on etsy to make money from it even ebay ebay is another platform where you can um, sell your digital product so let's go to ebay let's search for um digital um digital planner you can see digital planner so ebay has Options for digital plan. So you can see digital plan of nine pounds, of um, one pound fifty. So it depends on whatever you create and that is suitable for you. 
I believe you have gotten value from this video and let me know what you think in the comment section if this business is doable for you and let us know if you are finding it struggling or if you are struggling or, or finding it difficult to understand if you are struggling with this model of business this model of business let us know and there is a way we can help you leave your comment in the comment section and don't forget to give us a thumb up and also share our videos and subscribe to our youtube channel do have an amazing time guys cheers